Welcome to another episode of White Boy Baccarat Fam. Today, we're going to be talking about a number that I call the golden ratio. The golden ratio is an important number that you need to know if you're going to try and take on the casino. Most people who are taking on the casino, who think they can beat the casino, they have no, they have no system, they have no math, they just have, they have money. They might have money. They, got a, they might have a big bankroll and they take on the casino with a big bankroll, okay? And they just try to win a little bit of money. They might be trying to win 10% or 20% of their bankroll. And in a lot of examples, if you just bring in a big bankroll and fight the casino and you're only trying to make 10 to 20%, a lot of times you're going to win. But that doesn't take advantage of the golden ratio, fam. Okay? And that's what, and that's what this YouTube video is going to be about. First, I want to back up about how I even figured out this, this, this golden number, where I even came up with it. Because fam, this only happened this year, okay? For, for over 20 years, I've been working on the math, but there's math that I didn't understand. There's math that I didn't know. When I'm, when I'm focusing on beating the casino, I'm focused on a round, which I call three bets, but it wasn't always three bets, wasn't always a round. 26 years ago, 25 years ago, a round for me was nine bets. I would bet $50 on player. If I lost, I'd bet 100. If I lost, I'd bet 200. And I'd go all the way up to nine bets to where on my last bet, I'm betting somewhere like $12,800. Eventually, I lost doing that, and I lost $25,000. But luckily, I had $25,000 in wins to make up for it, so it was a break-even. But the table used to always watch me, the Big, ba the big Baccarat table. We call it Big Bac, where it's hard to find these days. All the Chinese people on the table used to look at me and laugh because they would be playing the opposite of what I was playing because I was martingaling. So they would laugh at me. Eventually, a Chinese guy, an old Chinese guy, he came up to me and we went, we went to the lounge to, uh, um, together and he was talking to me about my systems. And he was explaining to me that I can't, I can't double every time that I have to have a back out strategy. He didn't know the answers. He didn't have any of the answers. But he knew what I was trying to do and he was trying to lead me, you know, to like my future, okay? So I, I didn't have to go on with these very bad systems at the time. So I thought about this. I plugged in the data for years of what he was saying and I eventually went to four doubles, which means I had five chances to win. That didn't work. I went down to four. So I had, I had three, three doubles, which means now I had four chances to win. That didn't work. Then I got down to two doubles, which gave me three chances to win in a round. And now we were starting to get somewhere. Okay. Now we're starting to get somewhere. I went down to one double, which gave me two chances in a round. And I played around with that, with the two, with the two bets in a round and the three bets in a round. And I played, I played around with those two for years. Okay. But I didn't understand my odds for those rounds. I didn't understand the math. I messed around with the math and I thought I understood, but I couldn't confirm it until this year with, with the technology we have today on the internet. When you can ask um, like questions to the internet to get, the, to get to your answers 
or to your formulas to confirm if it's true or not. Long story short, after all these years, I knew that it was around is supposed to be three bets, that somehow your advantage lied within these three bets. So when I'm trying to beat a game, I have three bets to win one bet. And as long as I'm winning one out of three, I'm always profiting. But I need this golden ratio to get to the break-even point of the game, okay? And I have this, I have this golden ratio for Baccarat, which around, if around, my advantage on around, which is three bets, for me to, own, I only need to win one, one bet in this round. And if I win this bet in this round, for example, I might play $300 for the first bet. If I lose, I bet $600. If I lose that, I bet $1,200. I have an 87.5 chance to win that round. Okay? Now, if we look at that 87, at that 87.5% chance to win, the casino's chance is 12.5%. I'm going to win for every thousand hands, that every thousand rounds that I play. The math says that I'm going to win 875 of those rounds and the casino is going to win 125 of those rounds. The golden ratio can be found within that number. And what I do is I divide that num those two numbers by 10 to get 8.75. And I divide it by the other casino number, that 12.5 number. I divide that by 10. And then I divide that 8.75 number by 1.25. Okay? And that is going to give me the golden ratio of 7.0. That 7.0 for Commission Baccarat is your break-even point in Baccarat. One, two, and four is $700. For every seven rounds that I win on 100, 200, 400, I win $700. Okay, the casino wins one round as well after that. And that takes the 700. That's, that's why Baccarat is the only game that can be beat because it has the best odds. If you look at the golden ratio for, for, the, for single zero roulette, you're talking about 6.78 because it's not a 7.0 or more. It cannot be beat. That game cannot be beat in the long run. Double zero roulette, the golden ratio for that game. The ratio for that game is 6.60. It, it means it cannot be beat in the long run. Sick ball has a ratio of 6.57. It cannot be beat in the long run because of that. Blackjack has a ratio of 6.47. It cannot be beat in the long run because of that. Craps has a ratio of 4.9. Look at how off it is. It's so, the odds are so bad. Okay? Your break even has to have a ratio of 7.0 is your break even point. Okay? Now, if you don't take that into an account, into account when you're building a system, it's going to be very hard to be profitable mathematically. So that's why this seven number is so important. And it's going to be so important when I release the system video any day now. Within the next five days, I'm going to release the system. But you have to take into account 
the golden ratio, and that's why the system is going to work. Now that we know this golden ratio is the break-even point at seven, how are we going to get beyond the break-even point? One of the ways we're going to do that is with the last video that I put out here on YouTube that talked about time manipulation, about manipulating your time in the casino with bigger odds. If you have the bigger odds in the casino, for example, the 87.5 odds are on your side. Now you have a chance to use, to, to put that time manipulation into the Baccarat formula so that you can beat the 7.0 ratio that the game gives. And you're, gonna, and you're going, one of your things you're going to do to take advantage of that is you are going to manipulate your time in the casino to be less time. You're only going to play one hand. That's it. And then you're going to go to another casino and play a one hand only. And you're going to go to another casino and play one hand. Because you are the big odds in that hand, you're going to win more than 87.5 times. The only time you're going to win the regular odds of the game is if you stay at the same game for a hundreds of spins. Okay, for more, for more than the 7.0 ratio. If you stay, if you try to play more than seven hands, you are going to be subject to the, the game's real, true odds. So you're not only going to take advantage of the time manipulation, you're also going to take advantage of my system that I call 7-Up. My 7-Up system I've been working on for over 20 years. It took me a little while. It took me till this year to touch it up now that I know the golden ratio. Before, it was 9-Up. Now it's 7-Up because I didn't know the golden ratio. I didn't know the 87.5 number that I know today. Now when we put in all these things into the system, when we take account of time manipulation and the other secret that I'm going to give you in the next video about how, how to get an advantage from the way you bet, how to beat the casino with a betting strategy that takes advantage of the golden ratio so you can get the odds higher. So not only are you going to get the odds higher from my 7-Up system, you're also going to get the, the odds higher from um, the time manipulation as well. When you put it all together, now you might be getting up to 5% odds in your favor in Baccarat. The golden ratio shows why Baccarat is the only game that can be beat in the casino. Most people here are going to have no idea what I'm talking about. This is 26 years in the making, and it's not something that's easy for most people to understand. And it's going to take, it might, pay, it, it might take people 10 to 20 years to really have a comprehension of what I'm talking about and why and why it's going to matter in system gambling. Fam, I hope you enjoyed this episode of White Boy Baccarat. I'm giving you the craziest information that nobody can give you because I've been doing this for years and years and years. For 26 years, I did not lose money in the casino. Sometimes I made money, sometimes I lost money but I didn't take big losses and I didn't take big gains. If I took a $25,000 loss, I also had a $25,000 gain. But uh, most of the time, my gains were minimal and my losses were minimal because I did not know the golden ratio. 
now that I know the golden ratio and I can adjust my, my equations to take account for the golden ratio, now I'm finally able to get into the profits. And I'm going to show you that very soon in real time at the casino. I'm going to be logging my data for you know the whole entire year from now. You're going to see all the data and you're going to see if it works or it doesn't work. But the next video I'm going to have, fam, it's the system video that you've all been waiting for. And it's, it's been updated to take an account of the golden ratio. So fam, this is my strongest system that I've ever had in my life. And it's not even my strongest system yet, but it's the system that I'm going to release to you in about a week or less. Fam, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Share, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you again soon, fam. Peace.